Okay, this is going to kind of be a long video uh, because I'm going to attach the video that I just shot to the end of this so that you can see the session that I just did. I did leave the lights on in my dining room. The lights are off in the rest of my house, but I had some candles burning uh, for two reasons. The first reason is because I have a lot of heavy wooden furniture in my house, and if my house is pitch black and I go moving around or if I have to run for any reason... I'm going to hit something, trip over, and probably break my leg, and I'm here alone. Uh, so, you know, if anything happens to me, I'm not going to be found until my wife comes home in a week. Because uh, no one comes over to this house just to pop in and say, hey, we don't have visitors in here. So, um, I need to be real careful about that. I don't want to get myself hurt. Um, and just the way things are going right now, my house is really super active, so... Um, if anything were to materialize in front of me or something, I'd probably have a heart attack. So, uh, I don't want to do that. So, I'm trying to keep myself safe uh, and keep a little bit of light on. I've got candles burning in the house. That gives me enough light to see where I'm going. Even if I have to run, I, you know, can see things in front of me. So, that's real important. I know you might be laughing at that, but I'm, you know, I'm almost 60 years old. So, I don't want to run into anything or fall. Um, I mean, I'm not in terrible shape, but I am an older guy, so, you know, I've got to be careful about, um, not, you know, hurting myself. Um, now, I got all, all kind of EVPs. Some were, uh, were caught with Parrot, and some were caught with, uh, Ghost Tube Blocks running on this phone. Uh, what I did was I hooked my old phone up to my home internet uh, so that I could run, you know, Ghost Tube Vox. Uh, I'm not sure if it'll run. I think it will run without an internet, but I'm going to try it next time, see if it will. Uh, but I did hook it up just so that I can make sure that it came through all right. And I did verify it. There's some things that... There are some things that I asked them, and they were specifically answered um, in reference to what I asked. Uh, I kept asking who's here, and I got the name Scott, which can't be random, because remember, this is the little boy that I recorded with this phone, which does not have internet, and goes to Vox, uh, which is the uh, paranormal app. Parrot is not a paranormal app. It's just a digital recorder. That's all it is. Um, so I got Scott, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven times, they said, when I asked who was here, they kept saying, Scott, Scott, Scott. I asked them to say the name of one of my dogs, and they said Lancelot twice. Um, that's the name of one of my dogs. Uh, the very that the last thing I got was a growl um, that came over Parrot over the digital recorder, and I didn't hear it with my ears at the time. I heard it when I played it back. So I'm going to play some of these for you, or actually all the ones that I got, and I'm going to attach that session video to the end of this one if you'd like to watch it as it happened. Um, <clears throat> now, the first, the first thing I got was at 47 seconds in, they said girl, and it came over Parrot. didn't come over Ghost Tube Box. So it just came right out of the air. they said that uh, um, the next thing they said was Scott no I'm sorry they said Chet that sucks okay they said Chet and that was over Ghost Tube Vox um, now I've gotten Chet on Parrot and Ghost Tube Vox so nothing that you're going to hear on Ghost Tube Vox is just something random that the, the app is picking up or the app is playing. Because everything that I get off Ghost Tube Blocks at one time or another, I've gotten on Parrot too. Um, okay, so that was Chet. I was really hoping he wasn't going to be around here, but that's definitely Chet. Um, and then uh, Parrot, this phone here, uh, someone said, hey. And the little boy says that a lot. He goes, hey. Um, just kind of cheerful, but. Uh, and then, uh, Ghost Tube Vox picked up Scott six seconds later. Uh, 
and then they picked I picked up Scott again. Uh, and then right after that I picked up Scott again. Uh, and I, I asked if Scott was here and Ghost Two Box picked up yes, it's me. If Scott's here, can you say your name for me so I can verify it's you? Yes, it's me. And that was a boy. Sound like a young boy. Remember, their voices don't always sound the same. I mean, there's something going on behind me. I'm going to have to recheck this video. It looked like something was moving behind me. I'm really freaked out now because I've stirred things up in this house. My house is dark. I'm alone. I got my back to the living room, which I do not like. Um, I'm going to have to play this back and look. I, I thought I saw something moving behind me, like right, right across here. Um, okay, I asked what happened to Scott, and they said a murder. That sounds like the little boy saying, a murder. Um, then he says, hey, again. And it was picked up by Parrot. I get that a lot. I got hey a few times in this. Uh, then he said, hey, again. And that was right out of the air. I mean, that's what makes you so freaky. Um, because I didn't hear it at the time, but Parrot picked it up, which is the way it usually works. Um, and I can't read my own writing. Um, I'm going to have to play this and see what it says. I can't, my, my, my pen was fading out on me. So I'm not sure what this is. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Um, my, my pen was fading out on me, so... Okay, well, I can't read it, but... Uh, my name, they mentioned my name. And this is on Ghost Tube Box. Uh, so I doubt they just happen to have that name programmed into the app. My name is Guyan, uh, so very, very unlikely. And I've gotten my name quite a few times on this, so... I was saying, is anyone back here? And I was back in my back in my bedroom, and I said, is anyone back? And they said, and Guy and my name came over Ghost Two Box. Uh, and then they said they killed my daughter. So apparently, someone's daughter got killed, and her father's in my house. And then they said, kill him. I imagine they're probably talking about me, but you never know, I'm assuming. Uh, and then we got Scott again, twice, uh, 15 seconds apart. Scott? And I acknowledge it. Scott? That's me going, Scott. Uh, and then at 7.35, I got Scott again. Uh, and then I guess it's Scott saying, I'm Scott. So Scott's all through this session, just all the way through it. Says, I'm Scott. 
Uh, and then I asked what my dog's name was, and or if they could mention one of my dogs. And they said Lancelot twice. Uh, if I can find it, here it is. That's Scott, that's a little boy. Lancelot! And then 10 seconds later, they say it again. Lot. That's a growling voice, so apparently Scott and someone else, probably Chet, is answering me. And then the last thing I got on here uh, before it cut off was I got a growl, and it was picked up by this phone, which makes it even that much more frightening. That's a gnarly growl. That's a gnarly growl. Okay, so... I'm going to attach that the video, the live video that I shot to the end of this. If you want to listen to it, you can hear the responses. You can hear every response uh, over Ghost Two Blocks that um, uh, that I didn't write down that I couldn't understand. Maybe you can understand it, and then listen with your ears for disembodied voices uh, that I didn't write down on here because I'm sure they're probably I haven't I haven't watched the video yet, so. Uh, but I'm sure there's a lot of disembodied voices in it. So uh, we're going to go on from here and I'm going to do uh, a couple more. Uh, and then I'm going to try to go to bed. I don't know how that's going to work out yet. We're going to have to wait and see. I'll talk to you later. Give me your name, please, so I know who I'm talking to. I just heard something behind me. My dogs are running around, but it wasn't that. It was like a, a knock on the wall. Give me your name, please, so I know who, you're, who I'm talking to. Is Scott here? Is Chet here? Scott, sir, can you say your name for me so I can verify it's you? What happened to you, Scott? What happened to Scott? Who was the English guy that I heard earlier? What's his name? My dogs are being kind of noisy. What's the English guy's name? Uh, Arthur? That sounded pretty sinister. It didn't sound like Chet, though. Where's Chet? Did 
just going to walk around. I'm going to leave this phone and this phone to do their thing. Please say your name so I know who I'm talking to, please. So you want back here? Can you make a noise back here? Can you tap on something or knock on a wall? My dog just scared the shit out of me. Can you make a noise back here for me? Who is that? Who's speaking, please? I don't like having my back to this room. Tell me who's speaking, please. I don't like chat. Is chat here? Can you see I got just got who was that? They caused it. They caused it. Just give me your names. Give me your names for now so I know who I'm talking to, please. Scott, that's little boy. <clears throat> Who else is here? I didn't catch that. Can you say it again? Sound like he said, fuck you. Wouldn't be the first time they said that to me. So who else is here? I've only gotten one name. Well, I've gotten two names. Arthur and Scott. Who else is here? More than two here. The puppy's on the couch and he's stuck. <clears throat> Can you say one of my dog's names, please? Say Merlina. Can you say one of my dog's names, please? My black dog, what's his name? Do you know my black dog's name?
sound like Lancelot. Okay, well, I'm going to listen to this recording. Thank you for talking to me. Goodbye. Puppy stuck on the couch. She's whining. Goodbye. Okay. I gotta get the puppy off the couch if she won't shut up. See, she's stuck up there and she's whining. You're stuck. You're stuck. That's what you are. You're stuck here. There you go. Now maybe you shut up. <clears throat> Don't get under my feet. Oh, she's gonna kill me. Oh, Jesus. I'm gonna break my damn neck on this puppy. Alright, I'm gonna listen to this and see what I... God damn this dog. She won't stay out from under my feet. Um, I'm going to listen to this and see what I found. And of course, I'll be sure to share whatever I got off of here with you. So, uh, talk to you later.